and welcome to Monday's edition of Making It Work. And two weeks left. The week after this is our last week of school, and then I work three extra days, Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday of the next week, cleaning. Uh, that's not going to be fun. Anyway, this week on my face is, first thing I'm picking up is my Ulta Eye Primer. And this week I am wearing um, the Ulta, let's see, Ulta Lip Liner in Nude. That's what that looks like. And it is a nice, pretty nude color. Uh, on my lashes this week, I'm wearing the Katie Cat Matte in... I can't read it. It's too small. Only it's got kind of a weird... And it is definitely wet on my eyes, so they clump a little bit. So you have to work with it. Um... On my cheeks this week, I am wearing my new Urban Decay blush in Fetish. This is the Afterglow blush in Fetish. And it is beautiful. On my lips today, I am wearing the uh, Rimmel Only One in 700 Naughty Nude. Very pretty pinky nude. I really like this color a lot. And on my eyes this week, I'm using the Gwen Stefani by Urban Decay. And so I wore this for my base, this for my transition, and this on my eyelids today. This is such a fun palette to work with. I mean, it is so... the. It is so pigmented and so, it it's still a little powdery. I mean, I have not seen uh, eyeshadow that isn't powdery. Um, I mean, this is less powdery than the drugstores, but it's still a little powdery. And, but it is so pigmented and they go on like a dream. So anyway, that is my Monday and I, whoops, I forgot one thing. I am using my Catrice um, highlighting powder in Stardust this week. Okay, I'll see you tomorrow. Bye-bye. Good morning, and welcome to Tuesday, and let's see what I wore in my eyes today. I'm wearing the Gwen Stefani by Urban Decay this week. What I did was this for my base, this for my transition, and I wore this color on my eyes today. And on my lips, I am wearing High Flyer Rimmel, the only one. Um, this is their matte shades, I believe. Uh, 610 High Flyer. And this is their case for those. And it's so pretty. Just right up my alley. I really like it. So that is what I wore today, and I will see you tomorrow morning. Bye-bye. Good morning, and welcome to Wednesday of Making It Work. And today I am wearing my Urban Decay by Gwen Stefani palette. And I use this as my base, as I have all week, and this is my um, transition. And today I use this color for my... Eyelid. It's not a whole lot different than the one I used yesterday, but it's got a little bit more rose in it. Such a pretty color. And for my lipstick, I am wearing the um, Rimmel Lipstick by Kate. And this is the color. It's 08. And it is so pretty. It is right up my alley. It's the mauve, mauve, deep mauve pink, I guess you'd call it. And it is beautiful. All right, guys, that is my Wednesday. I'll talk to you tomorrow.
Bye. Good morning and welcome to my Thursday and here's what I'm wearing on my eyes today. Gwen Stefani palette of course by Urban Decay and I'm wearing today I'm wearing this uh, as my base this is my transition and I am wearing this color as my eyelid color today and it's kind of a um, champagne -y color very pretty on my lips I am wearing the Rimmel the only one matte and this is in 200 salute and it's a really pretty um, ma or nude color and that is my makeup for the day um, my eyes the one thing about that shadow it is glittery and so I've got glitter under my eyes again that and once you get glitter under there it's almost impossible to remove unless you wash your face again and I'm not gonna do that so all right I'll see you tomorrow it's Friday Bye -bye. it's Friday <laughs> I'm always so happy on Fridays including today I've got nine days left to work so it's counting down now all right so this week I started with my Revlon Color Stay Brow Pencil in Light Brown. Soft Brown. I love that slanted tip. And I I like the color. I like this the soft brown on me. So um okay. Then I went with my Ulta Eye Primer. Um, I'm also using the Ulta Lip Liner in nude these are so creamy and go on like a dream um, I don't know how long they stay after your lipstick's gone I don't think they stay but um, I have not worn a dark color yet so I don't know if they stay in your your lips or not but all right, then I'm wearing my um, Catrice Highlighting Powder in Stardust. I like this one, but I like the Champagne Campaign one better. This one's pretty. I think the Champagne Campaign has more um, pigment in it than this one does, to tell you the truth. And I'm wearing my Urban Decay Blush and Fetish. I love this. Of course, during the week I use a very light hand, but this here is just the most gorgeous blush. I love it. Wearing my Katie Cat Eye, um, my cover girl, in, uh, I don't know what it is, but this is what the, it looks like. You have to be careful of this wand, that it doesn't have too much product on it. You have to be very careful. But, um, so far it's okay. You know, it's not my favorite, but it's okay. For my eyes this week, I wore the Urban Decay uh, Gwen Stefani palette. And like I did all week, I used this as my base, and this is my, um, transition. And today I wore this gold on my eyes. Just such a beautiful palette. I love this palette. I love Urban Decay shadows. All right, and on my lips today, I wore um, Rimmel's The Only One uh, in 200. It's a keeper. Beautiful, beautiful color. Um, love these lipsticks. The Only One. I They're so... I've got... I think all I have is four of them. No, I've got a couple red colors too, so I've got more than that. But my reds are in a different drawer. These are all of them. And and I wore the Kate by Rimmel on Wednesday. And I liked them all. These red ones are the matte, and these are the creamy. Beautiful, beautiful lipsticks. 
they go on like a dream. They they are so pretty. They're um, just creamy. Well, the matte ones, of course, are matte. Um, and they do look shiny when you first put them on, but they do dry down to a matte. You cannot rub your lips together with them because they're matte. Um, I really like them a lot. So that, anyway, guys, that is my uh, week. <sighs> this week and it's been crazy uh, we've been so getting busy you know um, I have I'm having to get very creative with my salad bar because we don't want to open anything new we want to use up the fresh produce produce that we have we don't want to open cans and stuff like that so it has been very it's been a stressful week, let's put it that way, um, because I am watching the whole line, and that and that means the home zone is the main meal. Like yesterday, they had uh, pork, pork and beef fritters. They had uh, barbecued chicken legs. They had mashed potatoes and gravy, and then they had um, grilled vegetables. You know, something like that. And then my salad bar, which has a lot of different stuff on it, and then the the um, there's another zone that has it goes by a theme all week like this week it was taco so I had taco meat I had um, refried beans I had rice and I had chicken with taco stuff on it plus all the fixings you know the, the um, salsa and the sour cream and all that kind of stuff and I'm responsible for watching the whole thing and making sure everything is full and they go the kids yesterday acted like they'd never had a meal in their life or like they were starving to death because everything was it was crazy um, some days are just like that but I have to watch the whole thing so it's very it's a stressful um, couple of hours there Plus, I have to have everything ready. I have to... I'm busy every minute of the day. The days have gone very fast this week. So I'm thankful for that. And I, I've gotten everything done that I accomplished to do. Or everything accomplished that I aspired to do. So that's good. So next week will be a little bit different because it is the last week. It is their finals week. Every day we will lose kids because they're going home. They're done with their finals and they're going home. So... Um, it's going to be a little bit different. So anyway, I will see you Monday. And um, if I lose my internet connection, uh, I won't be uploading like I was. I'll, I'm going to try to go to um, running into a little bit of money situation. So my cable and my, my internet are going to be shut off. My phone is shut off right now. Um, crazy and um, so my cable and my phone my internet's gonna be shut off so I'm looking into another company of just having the internet because um, I can't go without something all summer long it's gonna drive me absolutely nuts so if I can just get at least internet I can watch stuff on TV I can watch Netflix so that doesn't bother me a bit. And everything is rewinds, re, reruns and stuff all summer long anyway. So, and that'll, that'll allow me to catch up on my bells a little bit, you know. So, it'll be okay. It'll work out. It always does in the end. You know, I panic for a few days and my panic period is, is going down a little bit now. And I'm starting to uh, think about what I'm going to do. So... I will talk to you guys later. Bye-bye.